hi everyone and welcome back so now we are like we have written a lot of test cases and uh, we were able to write synchronous test cases and async test cases which is dealing with the callback promises async away okay now next thing is we will also talk about the code coverage and there are two po popular libraries out there to give you the code coverage one is Istanbul and another is NYC I mean NYC is the extended version of Istanbul only we were using Istanbul earlier now everybody is using uh, NYC only okay so how to get the coverage and how to get the coverage report that is important right so you just need to execute these commands npm run cover what it will do is when I do npm run cover it is executing a simple test case it's not generating the report npm run cover okay so it will execute all the test cases and it will give me this particular coverage 85 percent right and if you want to generate the report then i have this npm script test one you can change it to something like uh, code coverage or something npm run and we will just change it to code coverage and we should be able to get the coverage report also generated from this you can see the report has been generated here right so this is Istanbul I mean now we have a lot of libraries we don't need to stick with Istanbul we can simply use NYC so what I will do is npm run NYC you can put uh, you can give a script name something nice okay npm run NYC so first I did is I, I have installed npm install minus minus even NYC Istanbul these two modules and with the NYC everything is clean right you see these are my test cases and this is the coverage for each and every file overall coverage and individual coverage of each and every file right so this gives us uh, the nice impression and NYC is something latest so either you can use NYC to get the coverage or you can use just coverage just we will talk about so nyc is really nice library to get the coverage now we have talked uh, about mocha a lot right and we have talked about a lot in the unit testing context but now let's switch our context how we can use mocha for the node.js testing right uh, like node.js end-to-end -end testing sometimes we wanted to do an api testing we will just take a small simple example and then we will move to the jest okay because just is that uh, tool we are going to use for all kind of testing okay so now in the next video we'll create a simple express application for now we are just using uh, simple common js modules with the node.js but we can also use typescript with the es6 there we need to use this ts configs and all i don't want you to move into a lot of configurations we can use express typescript project there we can simply use just or mocha or super test to get the coverage so super test and mocha works well together when it comes to do the end-to-end -end testing of apis so till now we have talked about only unit testing and we will also talk about unit testing with the jest but uh, simply i just wanted to cover how to do a simple api testing for node.js okay then we will move to uh, jest okay uh, see you in the next video guys thanks everyone